Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be doing a fight between Wolverine and Five Stars Sentinel. Uh, special thanks to IPID79 for letting us duel his character. Uh, I wanted to do this match because there's been a lot of talk on the forums about how Wolverine is going to be useless in uh, Map 5 in the new AQ format. And uh, obviously the reasons for that is because the Sentinel is bleed and poison immune, and he doesn't take a lot of damage from Wolverine's hits, as you can see. So I just wanted to do this video to see what he would be like. Uh, I'm dodging the L1 most of the time. Once in a while, I'll throw in a, a, an SB2 just to try to avoid that. Uh, I have a feeling during the actual map I'll be trying to focus on the SB1. I'm not 100% sure the SP3 is going to be available uh, in AQ. I'm hoping it's not, because uh, I'd rather not have to deal with it. And we also have to remember that each of the nodes, uh, Mutant, Skill, Cosmic, and so forth, the Sentinels have different abilities. And a couple of them are power games, so that's going to be a little tricky. But my real question was, could Wolverine finish the Sentinel uh, quickly? And obviously he cannot. Uh, I've already done this whole fight, so I know the results. And it takes about 4 minutes and 30 seconds for me to take this guy down. And that's me doing the SP2 a couple times, but in AQ I kind of like to keep Wolverine's power all the way to the top. because. Obviously, when uh, you get hit, you want to have regen come back at its best potential. So, I'm thinking by the looks of it, that when we are going to be fighting Sentinels, the first couple days, one, two, maybe three, Wolverine will still be a pretty good option. Uh, you know, it's going to take a while to take the Sentinel down, but you'll have the healing when you make the mistakes. But day four, day five for the higher, for the higher tiers, you know, the experts in the higher, it's going to be a rough go for Wolverine to take these guys down. So you might have to look at taking another champ. Of course, we're going to have to see when the actual day arrives, which is actually today. And uh, we'll see if he's still a viable champ for AQ. I mean, Wolverine's still an awesome champ for doing questing, but uh, he was always kind of my go-to guy in uh, in AQ. Uh, I brought him up to six, SIG 99 just for AQ. He wasn't the biggest hitter, but, you know, you could always count on him to regeneration if, uh, if he got hurt. We're getting close to the end here. Even on the de debuff immune nodes in the old AQ system, he was still a good option. Uh, I could always take down the champs on day five. And if you messed up a couple times, he'd bring back that regeneration. It was just great. But I'm a little worried about the Sentinels when they're debuff immune. They're going to be tougher, tougher to evade, especially the first few days, because honestly, I don't have a lot of experience in the, oh, see I got hit right there. Don't have a lot of experience at dodging his SP1, SP2, especially his SP2. So it's gonna take a while to get used to it. Okay, we're getting down to the very end. Again, this video is just to show what Wolverine could do against a high level Sentinel. Uh, HQ is gonna be different because of the nodes, so we'll see how it turns out and uh, Good luck to everyone on the AQ days and thanks for watching. Take care.